ಸಿದ್ದರಾಮಯ್ಯ ಡಿ ಕೆ ಶಿವಕುಮಾರ್ ಸೆವರಲ್ ಮಿನಿಸ್ಟರ್ಸ್ ದೇ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಫಿನಿಶ್ ಅಸ್ ನೋ ಬಡ್ ಈಸ್ ಪರ್ಮನೆಂಟ್ ಎನಿಮೀಸ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪೊಲಿಟಿಕಲ್ ಇಶ್ಯೂ ಎವ್ರಿಬಡಿ ನೋಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಗೌರ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಎ ವರ್ಸ್ ಗೌರ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಎವ್ರಿಬಡಿ ಫೀಲ್ಸ್ ನರೇಂದ್ರ ಮೋದಿ ಇಸ್ ದ ಬೆಟರ್ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಅಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಸರ್ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಸೊ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಟು ಅವರ್ ಶೋ ಸೊ ಜೆ ಡಿ ಎಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಫೈಟಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ತ್ರೀ ಸೀಟ್ಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಲೋಕಸಭಾ ಎಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ಅ ಬ್ಯಾಡ್ ಔಟಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಅಸೆಂಬ್ಲಿ ಎಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ಸ್ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಇಯರ್ ಹೌ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಎಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಫಾರ್ ದಿ ಪಾರ್ಟೀಸ್ ಡೆಫಿನೆಟ್ಲಿ ದಿಸ್ ಎಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಕ್ರೂಷಿಯಲ್ ಎಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಫಾರ್ ಅಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಕ್ರೂಷಿಯಲ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದಿಸ್ ಎಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಅಗೇನ್ ರೀಬೌನ್ಸ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ all the three as a parliamentary segment we must win that is our challenge now up till now actually after the alliance one side even party workers are struggling very hard to win all the three seats up till now there is no damage at all we come back after this election result with the confidence of our workers not only confidence people's blessings I have full confidence in that we will revive our party after this election what is the ground reality sir? i mean uh, is the uh, party in a comfortable position now the no, ground reality even though you now actually we had an alliance with bjp we are now partner of nda even that thing it would not happen in this election on our own there there was a possibility of winning 3 to 4 seats this time according to assembly 2024 results in mandya kolar then hasan then tumkur parliamentary segment wise if you analyze what share uh what uh, what share we have taken in this four constituency we are comfortably would have win on our own also but the <coughs> issue in this elections particularly money is also required if you go independently lot of problem for the regional party to invest the expectation from the several sections that's why we join hand with bjp also not only that if you had have not join hand with them this congress what they promised to the karnataka citizens how they are administer administering the government everybody knows it now only to save future not only development the damage which will going to take place on the basis that this government primarily when the farm the government itself the way in which they are going 200% it will going to be a disaster to the karnataka for that reason only we join hand with bjp to remove this kind of government from power otherwise kannadigas will going to suffer a lot for that reason only we join hand with bjp if you are not joined hand with bjp congress would have win more than 15 20 seats okay. what they are every day telling okay. by the division of votes bjp and jds not to divide the vote of jds and bjp we decided to jointly work out Uh, sir is there a good coordination between the party leaders and workers on the ground sir yes it is there actually some uh, small bickerings will be there in all parties that will not going to affect on the prospects of the party uh, have you tried settling all the local issues sincerely sir? sincerely we worked out to sort it out or sort it out the all the problem uh, leaders in between leaders and our party workers some small differences all those things we had succeeded 
to bring them with mutual understanding so do you think uh, the result of this election here will have any repercussion on the congress government sir certainly some repercussion will be there but we can't uh, give the deadline uh -huh. after this election any moment any time anything may happen because why i am telling this i am not a uh, astrologer the development in bjp j congress after the form of the government in karnataka the ministers themselves independently they are telling their own views that this this thing has to be done by the high command they have to take this kind of decisions they are demanding previously it was not there whatever the high command uh, given direction to them they are following that direction but nowadays individual leaders they are advising the high command not only high command your chief minister your deputy chief minister several leaders who are in power now who are not in power they wanted something from the crucial uh, time what they are facing now mm -hmm. that uh, issue only it will going to destroy the future of the congress in karnataka sir do you think uh, guarantees uh, of the congress is giving a tough time uh, for the alliance uh, because on ground a lot of people have expressed yes, happiness actually, with we have to accept it this guarantee program from the day one they try to brainwash the voters from the day one other than that they have not done any development work mm. in uh, publicity by day, giving huge publicity every day they are uh, announcing these programs they wanted to fix the people's mind in this guarantee scheme for that actually one section of women voters particularly they are actually with uh, one section some percent they have already with congress so what are you trying to woo those kind of voters sir? i mean what would be the agenda no it is not necessary for us to uh, take some decision to remove the people's mind about five guarantees some section they are happy that is number is not high some low percentage of voters they are attracted towards this guarantee but majority of the opinion in the ground ground they are not happy with these these programs they want permanent solution the persons who are thinking about the development of the country or the state to save their family they are not happy with this kind of guarantees they want more issues from government to benefit the families with permanent solution that's why i am telling you one section they are happy with this, this small amount but majority of the <coughs> voters they are not happy sir why is there an increased uh, spat uh, between you and uh, uh, deputy chief minister dk shiva no, i have no i have no angry or anything about uh, uh, shiv kumar only thing what he criticizes our party and our leadership in the public he wanted to finish our party that is their agenda several issues he attacking me that is that is the main root cause unnecessarily is trying to quarrel with, the, with us personal issues is taking then he wanted to actually he wanted to finish our image also by unnecessary taking silly issues all those things we are watching that's why actually this thing has happened he is not an enemy to me permanently nobody is permanent enemy in this political issue but only thing the way in which they is behaving is behaving 
with the huge money, illegal money collecting, with the power, that will going to see in future days, it will not permanently help him by using money power or government power. Sir, this kind of uh, fight, a verbal uh, oh, exchange between you and Mr. Shiva Kumar, is it going to I am, I am not, I am not a broadcast for that. He is the main culprit in this. So, will, will it divide uh, the community vote, sir? There is no question of dividing community vote. He can't become a community leader. He only express. He do, doesn't want to take the name of his Vakariga Savior. He only expressed. He is telling actually, he is representing everybody. Then how we can become a uh, Vakaliga uh, leader? How, why this Vakaliga voters, they believe him? So has the threat to JDS from Congress leaders has come down, sir, post your alliance? No, serious threat is going on. Sidharamaya, DK Shukumar, several ministers, they want to finish us. Ex openly they expressed in the public meeting campaign. Their main agenda is to finish myself and Revana son in Asan and Mandia. They wanted to finish us. For that, several kind of illegal things they are moving now. We are watching. Their main agenda is they are ready to leave all the 26 seats. Only thing they want to finish these two seats. Sir, will the alliance with BJP be dependent on the election results or is it a long lasting uh, alliance? No, our intention when we join hand with BJP, we have to move with them permanently. For that actually we decided. But the way in which things will develop, the, the way in which they reciprocally treat us, all those things will depend for future our alliance. So we also see uh, yourself uh, and your father and many workers you know, actually going out of the way to campaign for BJP candidates. No, they are sincerely a party where we have given the direction. You please follow the Maitri Dharma. Every party workers from lower cadre to higher cadre we have given direction them to sincerely work to win all the 28 candidates, particularly BJP candidates, our party workers, they are sincerely working. So, but is, is the BJP or uh, the BJP leaders also working on the same uh, page? Uh? Majority of BJP leaders, they are working. 99.9%. Some 0.1%, some this local factor, they are not happy. That is not going to affect on the prospectus of the winning the candidates from both the parties. This is small issues. Small number is there, but it will not going to affect by them. So, what is the biggest, uh, what are the two biggest agendas in this election, sir, between the NDA alliance and uh, the Congress? Or what grounds are you facing? Uh, Here, people are not happy with the Congress administration from last 11 months. Everybody knows. This government is a worse government. Corrup corruption also, it has went on to the sky level. They are not seeing the people feelings. Above the feeling, they decided to loot the state. People knows about that uh, the attitude of the Congress. The NDA issue. Now we why we join hand with NDA. Our main intention in particularly irrigation issues from last 77 years several governments i am not particularly show finger on any particular party several government other than devagoda when he ruled the country for 10 months all governments they let down karnataka particularly in irrigation subject not only the development work also Compared to our neighboring states, Tamil Nadu or uh, Andhra or Telangana, we are let down by the several central governments. Further, actually, 
we join hand with bjp everybody now they feel that narendra modi is the alternative for third time also the stable leader we required stable to to strengthen the era economic issues also everybody feels narendra modi is the better person at this juncture by using that strength by joining hand with them whatever issues we are facing from last 77 years to sort it out all those things get good result we have joined hand with bjp that will make it to be an agenda sir one if the that yeah that also everybody discussing the make it to congress they made a padyatra from sangama to bangalore by in the name of namma niru namma ko but what they have taken the decision 11 month what is going on not a inch of the development of make it that issue it has moved mm. where it is there there itself it is there this make it that issue is raised not now from last i think 35 40 years this issue is going on for that actually we wanted to get a permanent solution i we have confidence that after this election whatever our request to construct a standing reservoir where whenever the shortage is there for both the state to utilize that water by storing that uh, area both the state actually they can utilize it for that actually we have confidence this subject will going to be fulfill clear by the several uh, central government uh, institutions for that will going to work out sir uh, uh, coming back uh, to the election thing uh, will the prevailing drought and uh, water shortage across the state will that uh, be a major issue on ground it is uh, there it is the there people, people, it has people, been people are not happy with the congress government the action what they have taken to save the interest of the farming community farming community totally they are in a very aggressive mode to kick out this congress government particularly farming community thank you very much sir thank you